this project has been going on since 2017. I was um, still in school and um, basically a professor of, of mine um, taxed us with going back in art history, Western art history, taking a master's, old master's painting and converting it into something contemporary. And I landed on Jan van Eyck's Man in a Red Turban self-portrait. And I think the reason why that caught my attention is because he was wearing a red turban. And as far as I knew at that point, well, now, now it's been, now it's said that it's a caparon, but it's worn like a turban. So instantly I thought, a turban is a very African thing. And that led me to going into my mom's closet, taking one of her um, wraps. We called it Lapa. And uh, wrapping it around my head, just like he did. It's interesting because when Pape talks about the, 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 the fabric, uh, from where he's from and where I'm from, uh, women from the, the continent seem to always have the same type of uh, fabric around them. I came came up with this self-portrait of mine that somewhat mimicked um, the pose that Jan was in, but at the same time, very African. And it was the same time in my life that I was trying to discover who I was as a person and how I fit into the fabric of this society that I'm in currently. I made it a point to, in a way, tell my story through the faces of others that relate to me. So that same year, I approached Benjamin about what I was thinking about, and um, he agreed to to sit for me. And uh, I captured his uh, his photo, and um, a painting was born two years later, two three years later. At the time, I it it was just me helping out my friend, but. At the moment when we were taking the pictures and going through the process of uh, the idea of uh, the painting he was trying to draw, I realized that it wasn't just a painting, it was something that he was trying to express himself. He was trying to, to, to show who he was and where he come from. Well, when it comes to um, what he was wearing, I honestly went back into my mother's closet to grab um, the fabric that was was put on him to look like a blazer. And the reason why I decided to, to, to go with that fabric is because obviously it was another extension of, of my story. You know, having my mother's um, fabrics, and plus I didn't have money to go and, and, and buy fabrics of my own. So, you know, that was just an easy way to make things happen. We started, you know, thinking about ways to convey who, who, who Benjamin is as a person. Um, and um, surprisingly, my friend Emmanuel, who also models, had the hat that Benjamin is wearing a painting. And he, he went in his room, he grabbed the hat, brought it out. And as soon as he sat the hat on Benjamin's head, we, we just knew that was it. Through the painting, I, I wanted to make a statement, you know, with, with the hat being more Western and the textiles that he, he was wearing more, more African. You know, I wanted to like find that perfect balance in the middle. My main focus was to depict um, young Africans in the way that I thought best represented them. During the 1400s, 1600s, around that time, all the images that came from Africa depicted Africans as, you know, these basically savages, even though our textile tradition goes back thousands of years. You know, so it, it, it was something that I was trying to battle with. And the textiles to me are in a way symbolic. I use that as a way to keep our ancestors connected with us today. At the time when, when he finished uh, the, the portrait, uh, I, uh, I, he called me out and he told me to come uh, at his studio and he had something to show me. And when I got there, I saw it. Benjamin. It's great. <laughs> 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 it's awesome. <laughs> it's, it, it's one of the greatest things I have ever, you know, uh, taken part of. You know, I'm glad to have uh, been uh, chosen by one of my friends and he had uh, a great story to tell through me and I am the face of the 
of the portrait. So, thanks. <laughs> You're welcome, sir. You're welcome. <laughs>